Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and Apple just rolled out iOS 18 for all supported iPhones, which means that RCS is now enabled on iPhones, which means that those of you who communicate with Android users should be able to do so without any issues and group messaging should work fine. But, but, but wait on. There is another speed block over here because your carrier also needs to support RCS. So how do you find out whether your carrier supports RCS or not? You will go into settings. From the settings main page, you will go into general. Here and you will go into about. Now on the about page, if you scroll down, you will see your carrier and if you tap on the carrier, it will change over to IMS status. If this IMS status is voice, SMS and RCS, that means your carrier supports RCS. In my case, it is voice and SMS. So that means my carrier right now does not support RCS on my iPhone running iOS 18. So I have to wait for my carrier to enable RCS on the back end. Next up, if you've made sure that your carrier has enabled RCS in the back end, then you also have to make sure that RCS is enabled for the messages. So from the settings main page, we are going to scroll down. We will go into apps. Herein, you need to look for the messages app and go into that option. Scroll down and right above the MMS messaging option, you will see the option for RCS make sure that is enabled and that should be it to ensure that RCS is working out of the box on your iPhone as long as your carrier supports it you have iOS 18 and you have enabled it in the messages application then if you go to communicate with your friend who has Android over here you can see right now it is showing me text message SMS if RCS is working between you and your friend who has an android phone then this is going to say text message hyphen instead of sms there will be rcs and there it is peeps that is how you know whether your iphone running ios 18 has rcs enabled or not and again it depends on your carrier as well which is a bummer of course